Yeah, last time on Persona 5 Royale. Well, it's night, isn't it? Are you still my baby? Are you rubbing her face in your boobs? Did I just see that? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, you're gonna put that. Do what you just did again. Do it. No. See, she wants more of it. No, I can't touch her because my hands have to be clean. So you that's put her face I in your use... boobs instead? No, that's what I used here. To... No, no, no. Oh. You were doing this. And her face was here and she was... The... They can't see you, but... No, her face no, was here. I, I was using my arm to rub her like that. No, no, no. Her face was here. Like, Cheeky was full on going... <laughs> You know what you were doing, Cheeky. I'm onto you. You think just because you're a female dog, I'm not onto you? I'm trying to steal my girlfriend. That little bitch. Well, that was something. Okay, we are back. And you're asking about my favorite Persona song. Um, there are two songs which I have been listening to uh, for Persona. One of them is, let me open up my Spotify, I'll tell you exactly what it is. Um, Persona 5 Royale OST playlist. Um, it is called Confession forward slash Secret. Um, it's the original Confession Secret song, but there's also a remix that I really like. Uh, I also like the Velvet Room theme, just because it's so chill, but definitely Confession Secret. I think it's really like, you know, it's like dun dun dun. It's a really nice song. Alright, let's see what we got here. Big lead. Is he going to give us more Mementos targets? There is literally a delay in the sound. I'm going to restart the PC, uh, PlayStation. There's literally a delay. Mishima gives you more, so I'd say, I'd say I'd do more Mishima times. Because I don't want to just, like, when I go to Mementos, I want to do, um, as many of those things as possible. I don't want to just, you know, go in a million times. I want to make the most of it, because I know how limited time is in this game. I just press restart. You should restart now. I am ordering you to turn on. Do you want to go to Gulag? Do you want to go to Siberia? Do you want to make snow cone? Yeah, I thought so, PlayStation. Good choice. Did you guys know that since World War II, Japan did not have a peace treaty with Russia. Therefore, World War II did not officially end until last year. Last year was when Putin and the Prime Minister of Japan created a peace treaty, thus ending World War II. Which means Russia and Japan were still technically at war. They're so lucky Putin actually likes Japan, otherwise they would have been fucked. They actually gave Putin a pet Akita, which is a big version of the Shiba Inu, when they visited Russia. And like, you see the Prime Minister of Japan's literally holding it by the back here, and Putin literally grabs it from underneath and kisses it. And then the next time the Prime Minister of Japan came to Russia, the Akita was like fully trained. And Putin's just like here, and the Akita comes and everything. So fucking cute. And the um, Chancellor of Germany is actually afraid of dogs. So when she visited Russia, her license plate was actually the numbers for Tsuka, which means bitch. I know, right? He hates the German Chancellor. And she's afraid of dogs because I think when she was a kid or something, she was attacked by a dog. So when she was meeting with Putin, Putin literally let the dog run around and she was scared the entire time. Putin, like, loves power plays. I'm telling you that now. Putin lives for power plays. When he was meeting with um, some diplomats from, I believe, Arabia, I don't remember which country it was, I think it was Turkey or something, he made them stand under a statue of a Russian conqueror that was responsible for, like, killing millions of people from their country. He power plays like a motherfucker. He is just like, what the fuck, man? He's also the richest man in Europe. A little known fact. But then again, when you're the president of Russia like that, how are you surprised? He's basically a Bond villain when you really think about it.
All right, let's jump right back in. Putin is lawful, lawful evil incarnate. It kind of is in a sense. I kind of feel like doing mementos. I kind of feel like doing um, more um, of this guy getting me some of these leads. And I also feel like doing the gun. I think the exams are on the 16th. I think we have enough knowledge to pass the exams. Uh, because our thing's on level 4. Let's get another lead from the big lead. I've got a big lead. This one's on a completely different level from what I've heard before. You want to hear about it right now? Yes. This one is huge. I'm sure you'll be surprised. I'd like to talk somewhere with as few people as possible. Inokashira Park sounds good. I'll be waiting. Hey! I have some great news for you. We're meeting in the park in the middle of night. Um. It's about the next target for the Phantom Thieves. This one's massive. Just tell me already. <laughs> hey, I know you're excited, but don't rush me. This guy is the guy. He's a handsome young actor who's been rapidly gaining popularity lately. He's great at acting. His solid conversational skills has even been in all sorts of commercials. If you manage to change his heart, everyone will have to stop paying attention to the Phantom Thieves. He's got to be doing some shady stuff, I know it. And no, I'm not just saying that out of jealousy. Oh my god. If you look at something that you hate about someone, it shows what you hate about yourself. Or what you're jealous of. I heard a rumor that a famous idol fell into his clutches. You need to act on behalf of the fans. Oh my god, does your cuckery have no limits? Calm yourself. Rumors are wrong all the time. Calm yourself. Calm thy titties. Kuma, what would you do if your dog could turn into a car? I would ride Cheeky into battle and lead my men to victory. Whew, 1100 followers. Nice. I am calm. No. No, you're not. Calm thy cleavage, Mashima. <laughs> cleavage is permitted on this. I will allow it. And thinking about it from my calm standpoint, I believe you guys can benefit from changing his heart. I mean, this would be the best publicity possible for you, you guys. Well, pretty good tactic, huh? Aren't I an amazing producer? Just you wait. I'm going to put the Phantom Thieves on the map. You'll practically be swimming in requests. Mishima's motivation seems to be growing stronger. All right. Is this a new target? That's right. I'm the producer for the famous Phantom Thieves. I'm not boring. I'm not a zero. Oh god, and the truth reveals itself. Hey, take out your phone. All right. I just sent you the actor's data. Why? Don't worry, the request will boost your popularity, guaranteed. After all, I'm the only reason you guys have gotten this far, right? Someone sounds a little clingy and in need of approval. Absolutely. Nice job, Pat Pat. <laughs> yeah, it's all because of me. My right bicep just started spasming. Stop. It's literally twitching by itself. Stop. Stop twitching. Stop. Stop twitching! I better not be having a heart attack. Seriously, my bicep is twitching like crazy. What the fuck is going on? Why is my bicep twitching? Calm down, thy... Calm thy titty, bicep! Calm down. I will work you out soon. Calm. Calm thy titty. Why is it twitching? That's normal? I have the Rona, Kuma. Rip. Fuck. It will stop. I better not die of a heart attack live on stream. 
Jesus Christ, calm down. Calm thy titty, bicep. Calm thy titties. Mishima was bullied for so long that he fully be uh, that when he finally becomes useful, he abuses it. You can't blame Mishima. It almost sounds like an overcorrection. Maybe too much caffeine. You probably locked a nerve. Yeah, it's normal. I get it a lot. Well, I've actually detoxed from caffeine yesterday, drinking uh, tea all day, and I only drink caffeine now during streams. The rest of the day, I'm only allowed to drink tea. It has very mild caffeine, which stops the withdrawal symptoms. And drinking a lot of tea can't actually be bad for you. Ah! Come on, bicep, calm thyself. You belong to me. Oh my god, it's twitching. Fine, I'll play with one hand. You'd be amazed what guys can do with one hand. Yeah, it's all because of me. Wait, you can actually play this game with one hand. And the Phantom Thieves success is thanks to me and the Phantom Thieves are changing the world. That means I'm the one who's responsible for those changes. He's gone mad with power. Damn it. That means I'm not a zero. This sounds like a man that's about to blow our cover. We better puncture his lungs and drown him in the lake. Make sure you check the info I sent you. I'll let you know once I found some more details. See you around. Puma, didn't you have chest pain earlier? It was actually pain here. Bye. But if you get a heart attack, I'll record it just in case. I should probably call a doc, but the chances of me getting corona if I go to a doc is actually higher than my chance of actually having a heart attack. Hey, did you know that there's going to be a summer festival in Odaibai? A summer festival, huh? How can anyone eat so much fatty food when it's so hot out? Man, you can't. You don't get it. It's because it's hot out that we eat all the meat. Come on, let's go check it out. I'll treat you to a skewer. A summer mm. festival, huh? You think they'll have any A5 beef there? Well, you should worry about finals first. Once those are over, it'll be summer vacation, so stay focused. Mishima is a character that people hate because they see themselves in him, and it makes them uncomfortable. Rest with the Phantom Thieves. Well, like I said, we always hate what we see ourselves as in other characters. Wait, does that mean I see myself in Mishima? Probably. Yeah, they're really taken off since the whole Kamashita thing. The Legend of the Phantom Thieves started at our school. We're practically one of them. Oh, fuck off, you cuck lord. And who can't relate to what they're doing? Punishing corrupt adults up to no good. The police should take notes. Kuma, the plant. <gasps> Quiet down. People are sure making a fuss even though it's right before exams. Behind Kaneshiro's arrest are those phantom thieves, the mysterious group that changes people's hearts. If I recall, there were similar rumors back during the business with kamoshida kun Help the weak and crush the strong. Truly a modern legend of the gentleman thief. In the long history of humans, the gentleman thief has seen briefly during times of turmoil. Now then, please look at this picture. Kumakun. Uh, it looks like a guy throwing a woman off a cloud. What the F? This picture depicts the final moments of Ishikawa Goemon. Do you know the answer? He did something during the Sengoku period that had him and his family boiled to death. Do you know what he did? He got in a fight. Missionary work. Fraud. Thievery. Thievery it is. This is it. Correct. That's correct. Ishikawa Gomen is Japan's most famous thief. He's very popular and some call him a gentleman thief. By the way, the Goemon bath comes from his name. Only stealing from the rich and powerful and sharing with the poor. Goemon's exploits have been documented in many forms of media, like kabuki and novels. Wow, really? Kuma's kind of smart, isn't he? Wow, you must be really smart to be able to answer a question like that. The network worked because I restarted the um, PlayStation. It's going to stop working soon. RIP PSN. You always call people you want to protect sandwiches. I usually want to protect them because they're idiots. <laughs> However, it's actually unclear whether or not Goemon was indeed a gentleman thief. 
Rebellion against Hideyoshi, whose campaign had failed. Propaganda by the government to sully his name. The gentleman thief Goemon may be no more than an illusion made by varying motivations. In actuality, most heroes and gentlemen thieves throughout history are something like that. Yep. Let's make sure people don't think we're just an illusion. But before that, you need to study for your exams that are starting tomorrow. But won't people get suspicious if we stop targeting people during exams because they'll be able to figure out the Phantom Thieves are students? We should actually ramp up our operations. It's open. Come in. Oh! Welcome. You're the student council president, Nijima-san, correct? Excuse me. Sorry for coming by so suddenly. It was nothing. Oh no, everyone's permitted to stop by whenever they like. I know the phrase counseling session can make some people nervous, but don't be. Considering you're the student council president, I'd rather they didn't force you to come here at all, actually. No. Well, I was advised to come, but I still chose to do it on my own. Good. Oh good, I'm glad to hear it. But please, there's no need to be concerned about my being here. Feel free to discuss anything with me. Uh, yes. Uh, right. So I shall. Huh. You're sounding more like the counselor in here than I am. She's a boss bitch, that's why. I, I don't understand. Some people get offended when I say boss bitch. How's that an offense? I call guys dicks all the time. Excellent grades. Exemplary conduct. Wow. You appear to be the ideal honor student. No. Uh, not at all, actually. Quite the opposite. I'm actually a bit of a mess. And I always have to turn to others for help. But why? I don't know. Some people find the need to be offended by anything. I mean, I'm trying... Try applying logic to an illogical situation. Good luck with that. Well, you sure had me fooled. Even still, getting help isn't a bad thing at all. In fact, it's wonderful that you have a support system. Indeed. Especially lately, I feel like I can't do anything right by myself nowadays. Hmm. Did something go wrong for you? Yes. Yes, but it's nothing major. I've come to understand all too well that it's a bad idea taking on more of a burden than one should. Hmm. You really do seem like someone with a mature sense of responsibility. However, that may be why people around you, especially the adults, who should be protecting you, rely on you so much. <sighs> adults, who should be protecting me? Had I been clever enough to understand that earlier, things may have gone a bit differently for me. You think so? <sighs> ah, you live alone with your older sister, I see. Pardon my saying so, but it seems you've been through quite a lot. But... Honestly, it only felt like the norm to me. But our lack of adult guardians has to have been hard on my sister, even now as well. And I'd be lying if I said I wasn't. it wasn't hard for me too. Do you still remember them? Your parents? Yes. Oof. Hey, so... Not as much about my mother, admittedly, but my father, without a doubt. In fact, now that I think about it, I may have grown up to be a bit uptight because of that. I see. Is that so? And are you doing okay now? Is your support system adequate? Well... It's not as if I have a team of employees or anything, but I do have people that I'm able to rely upon well. Of course, I'd never think of them as replacements for my father or my sister. No one could replace either of them. What I've lost won't ever come back. I just need to keep my chin up and push towards my future. Quite. Hmm, I like the way you put that. No one can ever be replaced, yet we need to keep pursuing towards our future. Should anything come up that you want to help with, I'll be here to support you. Though my skills are pretty limited. <laughs> Thank you, I appreciate the kind words. Hey! Hope you're ready for exams. I'm pretty sure... I You'd be pretty sad if the leader of the fan thieves got bad grades. Shut up, talking cat! Track is back. Exams are close. Ooh! I don't think he's interested in me. It's a new week, so we better get all out. Oh my god, I forgot to get the katsu on a Sunday. Shut up, Morgana. No! No! Oh! 
I instant transmission like Goku. Best bro is with you for life. I like that that's coming oh. from a girl, best bro, but who is best bro is the real question. My support system is a group of LSD thieves. <laughs> and a Kuma. I was like, wait, a Kuma on LSD? That's a scary thought. Oh yeah. Is he violent? Very. Whoop, oh, wrong one. Instant transmission. I love how Kuma has a bunch of these drinks but never uses them. You must be new here. You obviously haven't seen me play survival horror video games, where at the final boss I have so much ammunition I just spray and pray, and literally ignore the mechanics of the boss fight by just continually shooting the boss until they die. You must be new here. It's a thing that I do, I'm hyper conservative during gameplay. Ooh, there's a guy in an alley, let me guess. He's not oh, here he is! Let's do it. Alright, here he is. You're here just in time, my man. Since it's summer, it's a good time for soothing soba. You think you can buy that for me? I've heard it's limited time offer, but they have no idea what it's being sold. Good thing I have you. You can find it for me, right? I have this Koedo sword ready to trade for you here, thanks. Soba. Where the fuck do I get Soba? Otacon, where do I get Soba from? What is this monk doing? You now quick travel to the temple. What brings you here, young man? I've seen ten emotion rolling in your eyes. Passion is not always dangerous, only if you know how to calm one's heart. Why don't you spend some time in solitude here? Maybe you will attain enlightenment and peace. Calm one's heart. Does that mean you can meditate here? If you meditate at the temple, you will be able to increase your maximum SP, however time will pass. The more you meditate, the greater the effect will be. Check your schedule. What do you want to do? Do you want to meditate? Fuck no. We are open to the public during daytime. Please visit any time. And of course, the fucking tourists that are taking selfies. The 7-Eleven? Lol. I'll just add this. Lol. I'm gonna lol so badly. 7-Eleven. Alright, we go to the... Oh, the line's too long. We get our butts to Shibuya. We get our butts to the 7-Eleven. What do you want to do? I want to do some shopping. What? Only one? Karaage King. I love how I never use this. What do you want to do? Let's leave. Instant transmission time. I think even if I vended the weapon, it's probably worth more than what I paid for it. What are you selling, old man? Here, that's expensive. Judging by that poker face, you've got the soothing soba, don't you? We can trade, huh? Let's trade. Ah, uh, yes, yes, of course. I knew you wanted the Koedo sword, too. Here you go. Come to think of it, I've never seen chilled noodles in Bianca. Are chilled noodles only sold during summer, then? Even the packaging screams summer. Anyway, this is fine. Good work, comrade. Let's trade again sometime, Tsuka. Alright, let's see what this item is. Oh fuck yeah, it's an upgrade. Trading with Slav, of course too much. This. Of course we trade, we don't use currency, fuck that. This guy's giving us a sword for noodles, what a guy. Of course he's an arms dealer, he's Slav. Would you expect anything less from him? I feel insulted. Allows you to see skills and potential items dropped on the analysis screen. If no negotiation with a martial arts using shadow fails, you can try again. Interesting. Hardison recovery. A chance to cure status alignments inflicted upon Marty members. Oh, right. So he has a very similar thing to Anne.
fanboy. Greatly increases XP earned from battles. Holy fuck, I need that. I need that shit. I need that shit. Is he here? Yeah, he's not available, is he? Yeah, he's not. He's not available today. I really want that XP boost. Like, I really want that XP boost. Like, big time. Big time. Because the XP boost is going to help us a lot when we go up to, um... When we go to, um... Thingy. Welcome, what can I do for you? Returning a DVD? Oh, we haven't finished it yet. You get a return? No, not yet. I really want that XP boost before we go to Mementos. It's after school. What movie show? Oh. Love possibly. Want to see it again? Increase his charm. Well. What's up? Do we have a priestess on us? Yes, we do. We have a silky, silky smooth. I'll just. I know what we can do. I know what we can do. Mishima's only available at night. Dirty boy. Track is back. Oh, let's check out confidence. Mishima's like come out of nowhere to rank 6. I swear. She's on rank 4 out of 5. That's shocking. The council is rank 5 and locked out. The Doctor's rank 7. He's rank 3. What's his next ability for us? Chance to reveal all of enemies' affinities at the start of battle. That's a good thing. Chance to cure status alignments. Do these abilities only work uh, if he's in the party, or do they work passively? And Anne's one, next one, is Endure. Chance to withstand an otherwise fatal attack. Fuck, that's gonna be good. Fuck, that's gonna be good. That's a late game stat right there, with one-shot kills. Ace tools. Allows you to craft an infiltration tool. Only when in the party. Fuck, in that case, and because she's got... Force enemies for ask for less, cure status alignments, and take a one-hit remaining. Sexy technique, grab the attention of an enemy, cancelling their action. That is really good. And female shatters, that is really good. I'll just add this. And what's the next uh, confidant for what's her name? We haven't done any of her stuff. We haven't done any of her stuff. We really should. Exams are close. Have your studies been going well? I can give you a general idea of what they were like when I was a second year. What do you think? Want to study together? So what's it going to be? Do you want to study with Makoto? Let's go right away. Alright, come to the library. I'm going to drill it into you, so prepare yourself. Study day. This goes like this. Now solve this problem using the formula I just told you. Do you understand, Kumakun? I think I can do it. This was difficult. I think I could say... I think you can do it. It seems like you're starting a little more efficiently today thanks to Makoto's help. Wait, did this not increase our confidence? I agree. Impressive, Kumakun. You're a quick learner. This is actually a pretty good review for me as well. Well then, let's move on to the next problem. I'll see you later. I think it's a good place to stop for today. What? Ah, you're back. 
No! I just had this. This is unacceptable. I don't study with girls for the sake of studying. I fucking... No. At least we acquired knowledge. Get that Ty Lopez bullshit away from me. Track is back. Looks like they're really gonna bring back the track team. The coach is gonna be Yamauchi too. The guy's basically Kamoshida's junior. I swear he's scheming something. Well, I guess I can look into that myself. Anyways, what are your thoughts on training today? I feel I can become closer with him. Let's do it. What do you want to practice? Ah, we'll figure it out. Anyways, let's go. I'll race yet to see who gets there first. Man, we really don't got a good place to train, huh? I mean, we'll probably run into Naka, Orca, and them if we stick around here. Got any ideas? Let's stay here. How about protein lovers? We can train at my place. Alright guys, which one is going to get me brownie points? I need to rank up Bro Yuji. Ah, uh, this coffee is death. Protein lovers is a good gym. Staying here, we're gonna run into those guys. And if we train at my place, well, I think, I think, um, Sho Sojiro bro is gonna be like, what the fuck is going on? Evo is saying we can train at my place. Koto is saying protein. Ooh, Evo hasn't been wrong. We can train at my place. You seriously think we'd get any training done there? I bet we'll just end up eating ice cream and playing video games all day long. That's just kind of what happens, you know? Yeah, I guess it won't hurt to peek around the gym. If they ain't there, maybe we can... Ah. Whoa! Nakaoka? Takeshi, the hell are you guys doing? What the F is going on here? I'm screenshotting this. Looks like a hazen. That's a paddling. We just have a few questions for Nakaoka here. It's none of your business. So what? You're gonna ask him questions with your fists? And anyways, ain't a three-on-one kind of cowardly? The only coward here is Nakaoka. All the shit Kamoshida put us through is his fault. He was telling that bastard secrets us. He was telling that bastard secrets about us the whole time. What? Huh? That's a load of bull. You guys should trust Nakaoka. This is no time for arguing. Ooh, 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 I wonder which one. Ooh, um, 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 you guys should trust Nakaoka? Sounds about right. Oh my god, look at those brownie points. That's right, you've been training together for freaking forever. Plus, ain't the track team coming back? You don't gotta fight. Shut up. I'm telling you, this piece of shit sold us out. How do you think I'm a shit I found out about your parents, Sakamoto? He's got to be a snitch. Get him some stitches. Whoa. Whoa, hold up. Wow, wouldn't uh, Ryuji be the tallest one there if he didn't have a hunched back like that? Stand up straight, bro. Out of the way, Sakamoto. We'll beat the living shadow you too if we need to. Did you just turn your back on a slav? You're about to get choked out, buddy. <clears throat> if you think that's going to make you feel better, go for it. But you're going to wish you didn't. Trust me, it feels real bad looking back on shitty stuff you've done. Huh? Look, even if Nakaoka was working with Kamoshida, ain't it fine now? The bastard's gone, so you can just put this crap behind you. There's no reason to fight, yeah? We can't keep people around who are going to try and undermine our team. But I didn't do anything. I wasn't working with Kamoshida. No matter how much you hit me, my answer is going to stay the same. Oh yeah? We've got proof. Yamauchi told us all about it. Huh? Yamauchi? Oh, motherfucker. Come on, Takeshi. We gotta get out of here. It'd be real bad if someone showed up. Nakaoka, shit like you isn't welcome on our new track team. You'd better remember that. You okay? What the hell was that all about? Just stay out of this, Sakamoto. It has nothing to do with you. But... When you hit Kamoshida, you were really hitting all of us who tried so hard to enjoy his bullshit. You might have felt relieved, but it was only it only made life harder for us. Because of you, we lost the one place we could vent for our frustrations. The one place we could really belong. 
tensions got pretty high after that, and things have just been kind of rough from then on. You really think it's all fine now, huh? Well, what if I told you you're right about me? Would you still think it's fine if I was the one who told Kamoshida about your parents? <sighs> yeah. If you told him, you told him. I'm over all that stuff with my parents anyways. Besides, hey. I've realized something, Nakaoka. I might have messed up with Kamoshida back then, but hanging on to the past ain't gonna help anything. I'm just gonna focus on being myself now, on being free. What are you talking about? Free, huh? <laughs> wow. Hey. Kuma, you getting what I'm trying to say, yeah? Absolutely. Right, he's the one who wasn't making any sense. Hmm. I guess being free is like, it's like how I feel when I'm talking to you, man. I don't get it. Can you explain that? Hmm. I don't think this one would matter. Can you explain that? Uh, I don't know how to explain it. I just feel free. Ah, uh, huh? <laughs> We're stuck on repeat or something? <laughs> I feel like my bond with Ryuji is growing deeper. Rank 6, chance to cure status alignments inflicted upon party members. All right. Man, that was some funny shit. So much for training, huh? Come on, let's get let's out of go. here. We should go grab some ramen on the way home. Oh, brownie points time. Yo, you good right now? All that mess with the track team, I guess I was right about my gut feeling. And Nakaoka can get wildly, weird, weirdly stubborn sometimes. He'll keep his mouth shut whether or not someone's punching him. Sounds like you two were close. Just like you. So he should have punched back? Ooh. I'm thinking just like you. Because it shows that you trust him. Or... Sounds like you two were close. So he should have punched back? Okay. Whoa, that's not what I was saying. No violence, period. I thought you were supposed to be the pacifist here. Clearly you do not understand Slav. Look, I'm just saying there's got to be another way to solve this instead of just going dark. And that bastard Yamauchi's name came up again. I swear something about that dude is so shady. Okay, that's it. I'm going to do a full investigation. I'll hit you up if anything comes up later. <laughs> no violence. Has a shotgun. I know, right? Ah, you're back. Just got home. Let me take a look at what his level 7 is. Because we're hitting that high level. We've got arm level 6 and chariot. That's his insta-kill. When encountering a weak shadow, you may destroy it immediately. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. That is no chill right there. She's got endure, which lets you survive. But this motherfucker's like... Pew, 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 pew. You know what I mean? Holy crap. So I could literally ride around on the first floor and insta-kill everything. That's fucked. That skill is how you farm in the game. I can see why. Holy shit. Because you can actually put all your skills to give you extra money drops and then just wander around. That is insane. That is fucking insane. Exam suit. That is fucking insane. I should write something. Kuma, can you sh check Yoshida's first ability? Uh, I'll check. Right, where was it? Confidant. Uh, Yoshida, where's Yoshida? Yoshida, Yoshida, Yoshida. Yoshida. This isn't Yoshida. This is Yoshizawa. Uh, Man of the people? Oh, this guy. 
Occasionally ask for more money or items during the- <laughs> Such a fucking politician. Oh my god, such a fucking politician. Give me more money! Oh my god, motherfucker. Motherfucker. Such a politician, I'm telling you that now. Oh my god, it's already 1pm and we're still playing, holy shit. Man of the people indeed. Also, the fortune teller can give you money bonuses when beating a shadow with all out attacks. Holy shit. Yeah, but we gotta do her mission first. I'll just add this. And I wanna see if, um, Thingo is available. Because I wanna get bonus XP. Is he available? How long have I been going? Man, we started four and a half hours ago. I should ago. write something. Man, we're on a roll. Sun also allows you to recruit higher level shadows during negotiations. Fuck yes. Okay. Hmm? Let's up this. Alright, I want this because I want more XP. Hi. The fans of these are practically unstoppable. Everyone loves you guys. Chuckle, as do I, of course. Sorry, I'll be busy collecting info today. Running the fan site isn't the easiest job, you know. I'll talk to you later. Holy fuck, did I just get rejected by this motherfucker? Wait, have I fed my plant? Did I feed my plant? My plant. And a crossword. A bureau back. Gotta feed that plant. I don't know if a catch is available. He hasn't SMS'd me. Looks pretty healthy. Oh, looks like this plant doesn't want food. It looks like it literally works on a week in the game. Gotta play the crossword puzzle. Let's play a little bit. Change with the seasons. Um, I don't know. Skeletons hang out. Closet. C L O S E T. Closet. Uh, decorative pattern. Changes with the season. The weather? No. Atmosphere? No. Um. Wardrobe is the answer? Oh, right! War. Drobe. Then what's this one? Decorative pattern. What's a decorative pattern? Design. Ooh. Now we're talking. Fair enough, so it was a closet. Wardrobe. In Japanese school, students change their wardrobe twice annually, in summer and winter, for comfort's sake. It's said that the practice originated in China during the Edo period. People were supposed to change their wardrobes four times a year. All right. I see. Oh wow, even I couldn't figure that one out. Nice. Maybe you got a bit smarter after a crossword puzzle. I feel smarter. Yeah, I'm an encyclopedia, baby. I should write something. Looking at my confidants. And Akechi is rank 3. His next one is Sleuthing. Chance to reveal all the enemies' affinities at the start of battle. I don't think he's a battle one. You want to do crossword puzzles? Man, I'm happy doing one crossword puzzle a week. What do they give me? Lockdown. Allows you to learn Leave a Persona to learn an attribute of resistance. Huh. Allows you to fuse three personas. I wonder what the next one is. Back Alley Doctor, the next one is Resuscitation, increase the selection of the revival items. Free time, gain free time in other teachers' classes. <gasps> I'll just add this. I should have been paying attention to the fucking confidant screen. 
I should have been paying attention. She's fucking worth all that money. I'm telling you that now. Ultra stock. Increases your persona slot to 8. Morgana. Allows you to craft infiltration tools. This one. Follow up. Coffee mastery allows you to brew coffee that greatly increases SP of one ally. Endure, insta kill, sleuthing mastery, lockdown, resuscitation, free time. Fanboy greatly increases XP. Fuck yes, diplomacy is for money. I'd hit that. I'd totally hit that. Tumbling allows you to avoid being surrounded, allows you to ambush from a distance. Increase the chance of flow succeeding. Chance to restore Joker's SP when it is low. Mother fuck ya. <laughs> Discovers OP abilities. I am calling that fucking maid. Oh fuck the guns! Do it. How the fuck did I forget about the fucking guns? The game begins with the teacher dating a student, being scummy, then it incentivizes you to date your teacher. Counselor is locked until September, I guess. I forgot about the fucking guns! How the fuck does a slob forget about the fucking guns? Fuck okay, yeah, give me the guns! <laughs> you again? I need to ask him about the modified guns. So what are you here for? I'd like to talk about the bag. I should be able to ask him now that I'm at guts level. <clears throat> Is that right? There was a custom gun that I modified to make it look as real as possible. I had a customer who was interested in it. He helped me out by smuggling it out here because I didn't get caught by those detectives. You're an accomplice now, so don't go snitching. I've got everything on my security camera. Ooh hoo hoo! I love that. Mutually assured destruction. I want more. I'm interested in guns. <laughs> I like how it looks around. I want to buy them. Hey. Want to talk in the back? Here we go. Who the hell are you? I am a true Slav. A gun enthusiast. At your age. Oh yeah, and I see the nice little carbine you've got right behind you. Mm-hmm. Well, I guess you've got the heart of an enthusiast. Oh, I've got the soul of an enthusiast. It runs in my blood, baby. <laughs> You're a strange one, kid. I am true Slav. Wait a sec. This could work. Hey, I can grant that wish of yours. You got a seven Estrella in the back? Gimme, gimme, gimme. But you better have the money. These things are worth hundreds of thousands of yen per unit. That's fine. Sometimes they even reach the millions, depending on how I feel. <laughs> That's cute. Not sure I follow. This sounds suspicious. Just let me buy them already. I'm not sure I follow. <laughs> Look, I ain't a bad dude. I've been known to compromise from time to time. For example, you help me out with my business. Smuggling goods, destroying evidence. Why are you just saying that in open terms? And as a reward, I'll introduce you to the special menu with good prices for a punk like you. Ah, so I gotta dip my pinky into the pool to show that I'm not a snitch before you'll give me the good prices. I get you. What do you say? Not bad, huh? I accept the terms of your contract, Zuka. That's a terrible deal. What's your goal here? I'd rather not break the law, pussy. What's your goal here? That's on a need-to-know basis and you don't need to know. 
I like that! Screenshot that. Gotta fight evil with evil. I need a pawn of my own. Don't talk to no one about this. Got it? Just follow my orders. We won't be able to get much stronger if I don't accept his offer. Now what's it gonna be? You gonna take my deal or not? I'll do what I can. That's fine. Okay, I'll work on that special menu for you. You should be grateful. I made a deal with EY. I should be able to ask him to custom my guns for me now in exchange for helping him out. And just like that, we met up with an arms dealer. And that is how I became a true Slav. It seems you had model guns in your possession as well. Their detail goes beyond a simple hobby. I love how it's not illegal to possess a model firearm. I'm sure some people believed those guns were real. You'll tell me how you procured them, won't you? Spill it. Oh, I'm so- wait. I never saw you had that hair brand. Wait, isn't your hair supposed to be grey? Why is it yellow? What the F is going on? I am thou. The Slav Persona. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. With the Slav Persona. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. Oh, fuck me. With the birth of the Hanged Man Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Hanged man, why? Cause slobs need to be hanged, you fucking Nazi. Allows you to customize your gun and install upgrades. Alright. Hanged man confidant. Oh yeah, when I don't got any business going on, I'll have you do some miscellaneous chores. Clean, run errands. There's plenty for you to do around here. Must be pretty exciting for an enthusiast like you, huh? I would love to learn how to dismantle your carbine and reassemble in under 30 seconds with field strip. It might come in handy with a piece of shit keeps jamming because it's American made Tsuka. Use a Kalashnikov like a normal man. That stuff will not jam, you put it in mud, it keeps fighting. You run over with car, it keeps fighting. That carbine, it fucking jams like a piece of shit. Hey. That's my contact info. When I text you from that ID, I'll be ne It'll be because I need help around the shop. Just so you know, if you get caught or anything, I never met you. Nothing to do with me. We clear? If you want something, you're going to have to work for it. Leave it to me. As long as it's safe. So what's my first job? Hmm. How do I get brownie points? I would say leave it to me. So what's my first job? That sounds enthusiastic. <laughs> sure gun, daddy. Hmm. I would either say leave it to me, or so what's my first job? What's my first job? Don't say the word job. Ooh, that is true. Sure gun, daddy. Lol. Hmm. Leave it to me. Yeah, that's the one I would have chosen. We'll see if you're actually up to it. Point is, we've got a deal now, so you better put in some work. Later. That's it for today. Head home, part-timer. None of the choices matter? Bullshit! The first one gave me points! I just didn't have a bonus. Now I need a hanged man. Ooh, the 13th. Yo. Sup. I've heard this, but apparently we're having a summer festival soon. I heard there's gonna be shit like kebabs, steaks, the hot stuff. Dude, I'm so pumped. What about studying? Is there anything but meat? Huh? Uh, what else do you want? Oh man, I can't stop thinking about meat. Piping hot, juicy meat. Is he talking about men? You don't see it in your guide? Wow, they must have changed it. 
The job, you gave you three points. Ugh. We will hump time if we have to. I control space and time. I can hump it at a whim. We have slept with... What controls time? I don't know what controls time. But we can shift through timelines like nobody's business. You know why? Because we're Slav. Igor's gonna be pissed with us. That time we jumped seven timelines. One more for the Igor squad. Igor's gonna be pissed. Krima, stop humping time. Don't fuck with time. <laughs> we're gonna get that creature for the fourth dimension chasing our asses. Was slept with King Crimson? I don't get the reference. Kuma, stop, stop, stop messing with the fabric of time for curry points. You slept with Fi? I'd do it. Anyways, where were we? Instant transmission, was it? Shibuya. Airsoft. Bang. Exam's coming up soon. You're not getting a jump on something without me, right? If you're gonna do, you wanna do it together? I'm in serious trouble. So what do you wanna be? You wanna study with Ryuji? Fuck that shit, I don't wanna study. Give me the guns! <laughs> I think it's more bites the dust. Gun daddy time again. Hey. Oh, a gun customization guru. Huh, you sure Didn't about you that? You look like a beginner to me. Oof! Mm. Well, I guess you got the heart of an enthusiast. <laughs> You're a strange one, kid. I want to see what else he says. Wait a sec. <laughs> yeah, this could work. I think this guy's German. Hey, I can grant that wish of yours. And what is that gecko tattoo? What gang was he a part of? Or is that a unit? But you better have the money. These things are worth hundreds of thousands of yen per unit. Sometimes they even reach the millions, depending on how I feel. So that's the equivalent of a thousand dollars being a hundred thousand yen, or a million being ten thousand. Just let me buy them already. You're not bluffing, are you, kid? <laughs> May actually make you more useful if you are. Look, I ain't a bad dude. I've been known to compromise from time to time. For example... Get a hangman first. We will hump the fabric of space for the third time, Tsuka! We are so gonna get in trouble with Igor. Igor is gonna fuck us up after this. Igor is gonna fuck us. I, I, Igor, Igor's, like, could you imagine Igor? Yeah, Igor, I have a report. What is it? This asshole just so happened to jump another timeline. Yeah, what did he do it for this time? He was getting bonus points with some German guy in a store. Yeah, German guy in a store? Are we talking about that club with the whips? No, it was the gun club. Oh, right, yeah, that guy. He occasionally pops over and buys some of my wee- I mean, herbs. Can I have some? Do you have the money? I'm your sister! Do you have the money? Cause I ain't running a charity here, sis. Damn it, Himiko! Himiko and her fucking drugs. I mean, herbs. Herbs. And just like that, we humped the fabric of time. How do I come up with this shit? I do not know. I don't know whether I'm like, I, I literally don't know how I come up with this shit. I, I must literally be insane. Hey, inmate. I must literally be insane. I, I'm, I have multiple personas in my head now with independent personalities and voices. And they can stay in character, in real time, and have a conversation in my head, which I then am just a mouthpiece for. 
What the F? You certainly seem composed. I am not composed. I don't even know if I am me or if I am an alter ego of the personas in me. Let us continue. Justine, you handle this. These are the paths you have walked. The inmate you wish to perform. Now choose! I believe we do not require Moon, do we? Moon is... What is his name? Yuki Mashima. I don't require Moon, do I? And I do not require... Not terrible, but not impressive. What the F is this? An evil deity of... Mess of Tolls of Folklore with eagle bodies. Who's new stole the Tablets of Destiny? The Emperor creates a tower. Excessive power only leads to... You can't handle this. You okay with this? Creates Andreas. Do you really need this? Piero. You can't handle Petra. this. You can't handle this. Thunderbird. Not terrible, but A not literal impressive. fucking banana. Wait, is this evil Santa Claus? A fairy in German folklore who carries a bag of magical sand, which puts humans to sleep when thrown into their eyes. If the victim resists, the Sandman will sit on their eyelids. This guy literally teabags you. Well, I know you're useful, but, um... Um... They will be reborn. <laughs> a skill card, huh? Enjoy that. So, this is what it will become. Gulags. This may prove somewhat extreme. And this is what happens when people stop being useful in the Soviet Union. When is Mementos time? Soon. I have killed a persona. I am a terrible person. You change your mind? You'd like to read the compendium? Meh. Read here. Alright, summon me a hanged one. Priestess, Empress, Emperor, Piero, Lover, Chariot, Justice, Hermit, Fortune, Strength, Hanged. This persona? Le Hook. This persona? Le Hook. This persona? No. Oh my god, this one's a motherfucker. But I just need a basic thing. This persona? Yep. This persona? Doge. Is this what you want? Do we have other fire? I mean, might as well make it useful, am I right? This persona? Yes, useful. I like Doge. You withdraw this persona? Go ahead. And accept this persona. Are you finished? What? You need a fusion later? Well, it's too late now. We can always summon it later. Alright, Ego, I wanna get out of here. Done already? Yes. What? I'll go back. It is time, inmate. It's awfully convenient that this is quite literally next to this guy's place. Love it. Let's do it. Alright, let's talk to Slav Daddy again. I mean Gun Daddy. He strikes me as a German. I love how there's these gun shops for gun enthusiasts all throughout Japan. And people spend hundreds and thousands of dollars on model hey. weapons. Because they can't get the real thing. Who the hell are you? Through Slav. A gun enthusiast. At your age. Mm, well, I get. <laughs> Wait. We'll get the third response. Hey, but you better have the mu- Sometimes. This sounds suspicious. <laughs> Is that right? Look, I ain't a poor example. You help me out with my business, smuggling goods, and as a reward, what do you say? Sounds a terrible deal. You don't know what you're talking about. This is a great deal. 
Gotta fight evil with evil. Don't talk to no one about this. Got it? How does he hold Just all these guns? The orders. How does Leon carry all those guns? Clearly he has them up his ass. Now what's it gonna be? If it's not too dangerous, because I'm a pussy. That's fine. Okay. That'll work. You should be great. I made a deal with him. With the Slav persona, I may get weapons. Oh, here comes Big Sis. It seems you had model guns in your possession as well. Their detail goes beyond a simple hobby. I'm sure some people believed those guns were real. You'll tell me how you procured them, won't you? Spill it. Yeah, but where's the suitcase? It would be a lot more fun if she said spread them. thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. Right. Wind fusion guide? Yeah, send it to me a bit later. Hang man confidant. Oh, my god. Oh, oh yeah. A neck. And I don't got any business going on. I'll have you do some miscellaneous chores. Sure, I'll bury the bodies. Clean, run errands. There's plenty for you to do around here. Must be pretty exciting for an enthusiast like you, huh? I love getting an apprenticeship. Hey. Hi, Saya. Did Makoto tell you about the baby? Saya, NANI?! She's like, I'll kill him! I'll kill him! He's like, Auntie, no! <laughs> She'd be like, that's my contact info. When I text you from that ID, it'll be because I need you around the shop. Just so you know, if you get caught or anything, I never met you. Nothing to do with me, clear? If you want something, you're gonna have to work for it. What's my first job? <laughs> Oof. Yeesh, take it easy there, cowboy. You're the eager to get into it, huh? I'll send you a message when everything's ready. Hope I can count on you, kid. Later. Okay, that's it for today. Head on home, part-timer. Yo. Sup. I've heard about this. Apparently we're having a summer festival soon. Hot oh, damn, I'm pumped. What about studying? Come on, man. Uh, well, I'll figure it out. There's some English on the website too. Oh man, I'm hungry. Let's get <sighs> moving already. Bing. You know, I know for a fact that a lot of people will be like, Kuma, wrap it up. Do um, mementos tomorrow. But given that Hutchins not around, no one's here to tell me to stop playing. So I'm just going to keep playing. <laughs> It helps you bypass level to fuse a persona by giving Igor money. I knew that he loved money! I could tell from the nose. So what if she's an Orona student? Why would she get special treatment? Results are what you matter, you know? I heard the Phantom themes might be from our school. That can't be true. It'd be funny if it was, though. Excessive power leads to ruin, unless there's money involved. In which case, by all means. <laughs> Today's the first day of your final exams begin. Oh, fuck me. If angle C is 28 degrees and angle A, D is 88 degrees, what is the angle of B and E? Oh, shit, I haven't done this for a while. Um, Alright, let me take a look. Uh, if angle C is 28 degrees and angle D is 88 degrees... Ah, uh, fuck, I remember how this does. It works on opposites. So, because of the way triangles work, triangles always have to add up to 180. So you create another triangle at the bottom. Um, based on what they have, the bottom's gonna add up to a certain amount. God damn it, I hate math. Someone just give me the answer! What is the angle of B and E? 64. Ooh, we can that do sounds this. about right. Ooh, thank you. Hell yeah! Let's see, an essay question. 
this looks tough, but let's calm down and think it through. Explain the origin of Baozi. Oh, Baozi. In this hot weather? Well, never mind. I think this came up in class. They were invented by some famous guy from Romance of the Three Kingdoms, right? Lu Su, Zhuang Liang, Chao Chao. Oh, Zhuang Liang barbarians' heads to offer them instead of heads. Ooh, clever, thank you. Yeah, the strategist Chu. I think the story was about a river overflowing somewhere. Zhu Liang visited, and they were offering something to quell the liver, uh, river, barbarians' heads. That's it, crazy story. And that's how he came up with Bo Bao Zai, right? This master strategist came up with the Bao Zi too. Offer instead of heads. Yeah, I think you're right. The Bao Zi were invented as an offering to a river spirit to replace the tradition of offering severed heads. Do you know that a spirit of the waterfall in Japan is actually a kitsune, fox spirit? <laughs> and the only way to kill it is with a blessed katana? Oh wait, or was it to kill a kitsune you need a blessed katana that is blessed out of waterfall? Oh shit, I would actually die. Yep. <coughs> you finished in time. Ah, give it up. I'm not giving it up, old crusty man. The one guy in the back who doesn't snitch on you, the fact that you have a talk to cat during exams. <laughs> man, that guy's a legend. Now everyone. This is the second day of finals. You may begin. Oh wow, the days are just flying past. Ah! Something went in my eye. I write the name and the genus of this organism. Uh, the horse air crab, Erymacris. A snow crab, Chino said. I think it's the um, snow crab, isn't it? Oh, uh, is it the red crab? Oh, okay, red king crab. Okay, fine. Ooh, we that can sounds do about this. right. What happened when the government issued paper and hard currencies in Japan for the first time? It caused riots, the government collapsed, it caused confusion in the economy. Um, the government didn't collapse, it just caused confusion. Ooh, that sounds about this. right. Yeah, so smart! Clearly, people have played this game more than once. Let's get started. Today's the third day of the finals. Are you ready? Then you may begin. I don't even have night time on these days. This is bullshit. What is the English equivalent of the Norwegian idiom reigning witches? Reigning bitches? Oh, sorry. Uh, wrong ring. Reigning cats and dogs. No, wait. Um, reigning frogs? I don't think that's the Norwegian. Uh, reigning cats and dogs was the European one. Reigning frogs, I think, is the... Uh, is it? Cats and dogs? Then which one had the... Was Polish reigning frogs? Was Polish the one that was reigning frogs? Then I made a joke about it being the French. Because they eat frogs. Reigning cats and dogs. Ooh, we can that do sounds this. about right. Which of the following is another name for the pseudonym noodles traditionally eaten on Tanabata? Um, 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 demon guts. Demon guts, I think. That sounds about this. right. Fucking talking cat. What? I don't get night time? Hmm. Today's the last day of the exams. You've seen all these before. You've got all this, right? Nice. This is going to be good. Looking forward to seeing your score. It better be good. Otherwise, good luck. After school. My parents are gonna kill me. There was so much stuff on that exam. I didn't have time to study everything. Well, then maybe you should have stopped hooking up on those webcam websites. I probably could have managed if I had an extra week, too. An extra week, huh? The only people who get that kind of cushy treatment are the honor students. Oh, you mean like Yoshizawa-san. I heard the school moved her exam period. Must be nice getting perks like that. Well, if you're good friends with everyone, you can ask them for the exam questions. What we used to do in universe... You know what? I'm not going to tell you guys that. I heard the school moved for exam period. Must be nice getting perks like that. Hey there. Hey there, Kuma. Congrats on surviving finals. Today was the last day, right? Indeed. Say, would you happen to have some free time right now? Sure, Professor Eisen. There's something I'd like to discuss. 
I promise it'll just take a moment. Sure. Sure. The counselor needs my help? I'll say sure. Thanks. I know you're exhausted, so I'll make this quick. It sure has heated up now that the rainy season's passed. The one trick I can tell you guys was that we had an open book, well, it wasn't an open book exam, but it was an exam where we were allowed to have one sheet of paper with notes on it. So I did the only rational thing. I created a double-sided A4 sheet of notes typed up on a computer in size 1.5 font. The double-sided sheet of paper, no, it was actually a single-sided sheet of paper. The single-sided sheet of paper had 12,000 words on it in size 1.5 font and minimal spacing. And I used different colors for every single line and example. So I literally had every single formula plus an example for every single thing. And it was like an advanced finance class, 69 viewers, fuck yeah. So I basically walked in with a sheet and the people were like, you can't do that. I'm like, what do you mean? It's like, this is cheating. I said, no, we're allowed to have a single A4 sheet of paper with notes. You never specified they had to be handwritten. They're like, but that's what we intended. I'm like, that's not what you wrote. And then we just looked at each other. It was just like, fine. And so they basically changed the policy that notes had to be handwritten. I was never the smartest person. I was never the smartest. I was the laziest though. I wanted to do the minimal amount of work. It sure has heated up now that the rainy season's passed. I just know my electric bill is going to start climbing this month. Anyway, as I'd mentioned, there's something I'd like your opinion on. Do you need counseling? Money troubles? Ooh, which one gets me brownie points? Do any of them? Lazy people are sometimes the most innovative. Well, that's what I did in my job interview. I said, I'm always the laziest person in the group. And then the woman was like, what do you mean? I'm like, oh, you didn't know that quote by Bill Gates. He'll always hire the lazy person because they'll figure out the most efficient way to do something. And then she was just like. Counselor needs counseling. Money troubles would be funny. Which one should we go? Counselor needs counseling. The doctor needs healing. Money. It better be good. Money troubles? Well, there's a subject where I could definitely use some input, but not at the moment. Hey, where are my brownie points? I've had something on my mind lately, and I want to hear your take on it. Oh God, he's thinking about dating students. Okay, here goes. Oh, this is all hypothetical, mind you, but imagine there's somebody for whom you have high expectations. Oh my god, Kuma, you should write a book with all this knowledge. I'd buy it. Lel. Maybe one day. Maybe one day. The book of Kuma. Oh my god, that would be hilarious. They're trying their absolute hardest to meet those expectations. Now, this person receives an awful lot of special treatment from people so they can perform to the best of their abilities. Ah, right. We're talking about the new girl. Yep, go on. So... What do you think those people will do if the expectations leveled on this person aren't met? They'll be disappointed. They'll turn on that person. I don't want to think about it. I think they would um, turn on the person. And the book would be 69 pages long. Indeed it would be. Indeed it would be. And it will be priced forty-two dollars for twenty, <laughs> or for twenty pages and priced at sixty-nine dollars. Um, hmm. They'll be disappointed. They'll turn on that person. I want to talk about it. Four hundred and twenty pages, sixty-nine chapters. Beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> that would be beautiful. Um, I think. They'll be disappointed for sure, but will they turn on that person? They'll turn on that person. You're saying their expectations will turn into anger and scorn, right? Yep, that's definitely true. Wow, I'm not getting any brownie points. What's going on? When you work as a counselor, you always think, 
I have to help this person so their heart doesn't break. But that's easier said than done. This world really is a callous one. No matter how much positivity or dedication a person has, just a bit of influence from their peers can easily mess with their heads. Every time I'm confronted with such a situation, I can't help but grasp the limitations of therapy as a profession. Reality is unfair. Life is simply unfair. Snails. You just have to keep trying. This may not be the job for you. Oh wow, the counselor needs some counselling. Well, this is interesting. Um... Hmm. Hmm. Reality is unfair. You just have to keep trying. This may not be the job. Guys, which one's gonna give me brownie points? Snails. Snails. It's always those damn snails. Snails are simply unfair. The Kuma Bible. Wow, the framing changed quite a bit, didn't it? Reality is whatever I want it to be. Number three, this may not be the job for you. Reality is unfair is what you'd say, but which one is going to give us brownie points? Three will work? Alright, this may not be the job for you. You could be right. Maybe I'm not cut out to be a counselor. What? No brownie points? <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to get all analytical. What I meant was, if we want to truly help people stuck in a predicament like that, we need a fundamental solution. A fundamental solution? A final solution? Like what? Hmm... Nothing really comes to mind at the moment. This is just a thought, but what if we got the Phantom Thieves to change our hearts? Uh-oh, he's on to us. He's on to us. Red flags. Red flags! Maybe have them shift our feelings so we won't lose to this unfair reality. It would ultimately be for the positive. Yeah, sorry. I just pulled the Joey and went, yeah. That sounds tough. Is that really a change of heart? That sounds... Sounds tough. Well, I can't deny that. Plus, it's a bit different from changing our hearts, now that I think about it. My god, this guy's snitching on us. Sorry, I was just thinking out loud. <laughs> just shut up, you Josh Groban looking motherfucker. <laughs> I seem to have lost track of the time. I should be getting back to my work. My god, you could play Josh Groban music in the background and it would fit perfectly. Our conversation's been very enlightening. Thank you. And enjoy your vacation. Man, he has this entire school under his hypnosis. Low-key, he's the final boss of this game. Not terrible. Oh shit, we can create Not ISIS! Impressive. Or Cyrus's wife as well as his younger sister. What? What? Alright, let me read that again. Osiris' wife, as well as his younger si- 